Welcome everyone, I'm Fausto Carnevale, Italian accountant and today we will discuss when you have to pay the IRPEF. What is the IRPEF? The IRPEF is the tax that um, hit you as a physical person. Yeah, I said hit you because we talk about taxes but we know that taxes is something that we try to minimize, not to avoid, so the goal is to minimize taxes. Today, it's, um, this is a very specific video. I already uh, talked uh, in this channel with Andrea about uh, the date uh, when you have to pay taxes. Uh, today I'm going to remind you because uh, a lot of clients contact us, they move to Italy. Especially, uh, I think you already saw this, that we, we advise most the impatriate regime or the forfeit regime. So you are a physical person. Uh, today I want this to see and uh, I'm uh, going to explain it with a, a specific easy exam example what happened for instance we are 2023 when you have to pay the taxes so let's say that you move to Italy the 1st of January so by the way I repeat I'm talking about IRPEF which is uh, Imposta uh, sui redditi persone fisiche so it's the physical person tax Okay, so suppose that you move in 2023. What happened? You will declare by the 30th of June of 2024 the taxes. So you will pay the taxes the 30th of June. So please keep notes of those two dates, 30th of June and 30th of November. So what happened? If you, 30th of June, let's say that uh, you calculated the IRPEF and you need to pay 3,000 euro or let's make it more simple, 1,000 one, one, one euro, lucky you, <laughs> so uh, you pay 1,000 euro of tax. So the 30th of June, your accountant sends a declaration, normally uh, earlier than the 30th of June, sends the declaration and call you, say hi uh, Mark. You know, please come here, you need to pay 1,000 euro of taxes for the 2023. No, you don't have to pay, then he said, only 1,000 euro, but you need to pay 1,400 euro. You say, well, what 1,400 euro? Why? Because you don't not only pay the taxes on the 30th of June, you pay also an accrual, uh, an advance payment, because in Italy, the 30th of June, if you use the historic method, you pay the 40% of the taxes of the previous years because you assume, or they assume, that you will uh, have the same tax impact for the 2024. So in 2024, you will pay this plus 40%. So the first year, actually, you will pay uh, the saldo, which is the total amount of taxes for 2023 plus a 40%. This 40% is calculated on last year. What will happen at 30th of November? You will pay the, the 60%. So it's like that the government try to, the tax authorities, to make sure that you pay in the same year the taxes. But, so only the first year you have this tax benefit, let's say, because you postpone the pay. What happened then, say you have uh, 10,000 euro of revenues in 2023. The taxes are 1,000 euro, to make it easy. The 30th of June 2024, you pay 1,000 plus 400, because as I said, you have a 40% advance payment. The 30th of November, you pay 600 euro because it's the 60% of this. What happened then the 30th of June of 2025 regarding the taxes of 2024? What, what happened is that you will pay a difference because, as I said, we assumed that the, with the, this historic method you, you paid already the 40% and 60% in June and November. 40 plus 60 is 100 percent so you may say i pay all taxes no it's not true because maybe in 2024 your revenues were were higher so this was not 1000 but 3000 lucky you again because it means that you are getting more, more money you know you're richer no 
so you will pay the difference in the 30 of June of the tax plus again the 40 percent so remember that the 30 of June you need to pay this if you have a VAT which is the most uh, common case the the account the, the difference is 50 50 so not 40 60 50 50 but I think I hope you understand you understood the, the logic here now you see I'm, I'm supposing that you have thousands of euro in taxes if you don't have to pay any taxes for small amounts you don't use this logic of uh, uh, so that was the my assumption is that you have a, a big salary as a matter of fact uh, when people contact us uh, they have normally a gross income of 60 but they would say up to 100 I mean minimum 100,000 euro so we are talking about for the impatriate regime we have also some forfait regime but so in this case even if you have a, a tax benefit you pay the taxes with the impatriate regime even if you have 100,000 euro do your calculation you will pay taxes even if uh, the percentage is very small so I hope you enjoyed this video uh, this was very technical so I didn't want to do it very long so the, the thing that I suggest you is to stop the video and watch it again and uh, most important subscribe to the channel if you uh, enjoyed this video um, and uh, also subscribe to the channel to remain informed to remain up to date with our great content and moreover if you planning to move to Italy the best way to do is to have a consultation with us a tax assessment a tax check we can call it it's like when you go on a plane the pilots do the checks so for you it's very important before flying to Italy to do your checks so you can do it in two ways you can have a free 15 minute consultation call in which we will ask you some questions to see if we can help you and the second point is to go to a website and book a specific consultation with us if you're not ready yet let's say you move in I don't know six months eight months you can buy a video course we did a great video course with a ridiculous price because we are happy to push the information out uh, you can study it the, the main goal of the video course is how to save taxes moving to Italy so moreover um, the 2023 is an important year for us we are also uh, talking about as you may have seen Portugal Belgium has actually I live in Belgium now so Taxa is becoming it is already the number one channel for Italian legislation Italian tax legislation we are the only English speaking accountants but we are exploring other countries other jurisdictions we are talking about in order to give you the best information if you want to move to Europe or if you want to move from uh, already in a European states to another why not so subscribe to the channel and see you next time Fausto Carnevale